Yo, 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 what's up? Yo, what's up, people? Excited to have you. Excited to have you and get in it with you today. Dropping the link into Freedom Team here. Let's get after it. Let's get after it. Can't wait to hop in and trade with you today. Um, I have not traded yet this week other than the bot. And so I want to be a little bit more careful today. I also need to fix my... Hold up. I need to just fix my display here. There we go. Okay, now we're cooking with grease. All right, let's get it. Anything you guys are looking at specifically this morning, huh? Wish I could move my face. So looking at spy. All right, let's take a look at it. spy. Also need to get like why is it not? It's like not cross transferring over here. There we go. Yeah, something's rest up. I only have one thing plugged in, so that's why I went. Sweet. Okay, we're looking at spy. Take a look and peek at it here. Um. Yeah, so SPY kind of gapping up after yesterday's low-key downtrend. We are in like, you know, more of a higher time frame downtrend uh, or longer term like this. But we it looked like we definitely bought them yesterday. And it looks like we're, we're starting to make that leg up now. Um, so definitely, obviously, leaning bullish here. I don't really want to do anything long until we take out this supply. Then I can start to look to, for longs. Um, if we do happen to come back inside of, you know, uh, the upper TLM line. We can look for rotation to the downside. Um, yeah, that, that would pro that would work for sure. Yeah, could pretty balanced day yesterday. So this could be either one, truly. Um, so you pick at Goog. Morning, John. Can you spy Nvidia? We're open. We're open. Uh, QQQ. Kind of the same thing that I just talked about on Spy. You could look for price to take out this high, come back, pull up and pull down into demand. You know, that'd be a fine play. Um, and then NVIDIA, let's take a look. Same thing. This one's actually even more bullish, right? Hit, hit bounce off demand, broke structure right here. Um, could look for a potential long right here, truly. Really. See if that's a pivot point on 15. Yeah. Could look for, I don't know if it's 50% though. No, not 50%. It's not going to be down here. But, um, yeah, looks good, too, for kind of a short-term swing. Kind of market's kind of shifting here, uh, which is nice. Obviously, really nice. I don't know about you, but I like when, stock, when stonks go up, not down. Uh, that's just me, though. Now we're lined up. Okay. Now we're lined up. Really nice of my wife and she was gone when I was gone. I uh, went to, to Kansas City this past weekend and she cleaned my office for me. It wasn't too dirty. It was a little dusty from construction, the new construction in the in the house, but um, she cleaned it up, left me a nice little note. You can see the candles and the picture behind me. So sweet. Um, but yeah, let's see if there's anything else that we could that we could look at trading today. AMD, I want to be careful. We gap up. Um, I think that's going to be a pivot point high there. Yeah, so be careful short in AMD. Um, Apple could potentially be playable for TLM. Um, Again, be careful with Microsoft. Kind of the same thing as those other uh, spy and QQQ. 
Same here. Want to be careful. Same here. A lot of the charts look the same, so it could, it could just be a weird day. Like we're all gapping up into supply in which we performed the other day on Friday, I think. Yeah, on Friday. Or the I guess on Monday when we formed it. So we're, we're doing that like across the board, it seems. Um, Tesla could be playable. Hmm. Yeah, I don't really like cues. I do like AMD, but I don't like how much we got the Trading bot looking spicy though. Up a hundred bucks on the week. Can you hear her biting the tennis ball? <laughs> yeah, it's my dog biting her tennis ball. If she keeps doing it, I'll take it away. I've gotten like right, I've gotten to the point where like I don't even hear it. Like, yeah, it's working well. I so I John, I actually went and bought I bought like the big one on accident. Uh well not on accident. They didn't have like the smaller option. So I bought like the the big large one and a little bit too big, too bit too big for her. She so didn't really enjoy it. I went in order the smaller one online she loves it it is kind of gross if it melts though <laughs> the recipe but not too bad i didn't realize it was that loud apple is pretty trendy though like look boom boom to close so I guess that's that closed right here. Well, yeah. I don't really see it rotating down truly though. I was hoping down than up, but I don't really see it going down. We do have supply here that's somewhat fresh, so that could be If Tesla comes down and takes out this low. Yeah, it looks like it's short. So it'd be like this, but probably wait for a pullback after. Probably enter somewhere in here. No, for sure. For sure, John. Come through the supply. Got a nice pivot low right there. Got like a 15 minute. Nice strong low. Yeah. Yeah, same for Tesla. Tesla's like two other, anyway. Either way here. The supplies are just a little bit farther. Goog off supply. Yeah, we kind of go through it though. So and we're not getting a we're not getting a super fast reaction from it. So I'll just be careful. See how I like it not, it's not aggressive coming off. It's just kind of lollygagging. <laughs> she jumped on top of my mini fridge and got the ball. So We'll be hearing the seagulls here soon. Puppies are hard, dude. They're hard. They're a lot of work. Whoa. I just got, I just shot up $770 in a day. What the? 
It's got to be a spread bug, right? What the? I don't know if I should close that. Maybe let's see if I can even can. No. So on a on the trading bot, there's a position open. The ask is three hundred. The bid is zero. <laughs> My goodness. I'm up. What was it like? It was seven hundred. That's crazy. I won't be able to sell it, but crazy. Dealing to trend down. Yeah, but what did we do, right? What happened? Yesterday's really trendy. And then we also gapped up and took out the high. Right, but yeah, if we start to trend down, we could. But even taking out this low isn't significant. Right? You really want to see it go like... And take it like right here. That's what you really want. Don't really see that happening. You do see this, right? Though I feel like you ask this question all the time, which again, you're learning. You gap up, take out high, take out high, right? So basically, just because we start to go down, like if we do this, is the trend actually down? No, right? Trends up. Trends up. It's just a pullback. You don't want to short pullbacks. I don't think Apple's going to come back inside, truly. Apple's going to look more bullish today. Same for like AMD, right? Same for AMD. I don't really love this. Now if we go boom, 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 boom. Yeah, okay, look just short. Yeah. You have to pay, you have to look left. You have to look left. Hey, chill out. Yeah, it might just be a no good, very bad day. Got wrapped up in my cord. Stop. Tesla's coming back down. Yeah, this looks promising. We need to take out these lows, and then I'm going to wait for a pullback, but no, this looks promising. This looks promising. I don't love how really trendy this is. I guess we opened up here, so it's not too bad. 
No, I definitely like it. So wait for that load of break and then hopefully not a stop hunt and then a reversal. So stop would be a doll two dollars. Let's go ahead and look and see what that would look like for us. Two dollar stop. Eighty five bucks a contract. Yeah, and I want to be careful. I don't want to get stop hunted. We did we did have a we did have a volume spike there. But I think we'd be I think we're in the clear there. To 1.3. I will let me look at a higher time frame. Yeah, I have some demand there, but not really anything else. Yeah. I like it. I have my OCO set at 201.3. So pull back right into here. Again, if we get it. I'll see what we can do. That looks really good. Just need a pullback. Like ideally, we were to take out that low, but even an equal low, I like that too. Good indication that price wants to go. Will want to go back there. I don't even have Mara on here. Did, did you have other confirmation? Yeah. So what do we do? All right. Trending up. Pull back. Take out the high. Stop. Was your stop there then? Eating a screw. Um, seventeen point seventeen point eight stop. Unless oh, your target. What's your stop? Come on, baby. Yesterday's close. Is that a Strong low, I think it would be. Yeah. Yeah. Come on, pull back for us. It's gone, isn't it? It's going to be gone. There's no way. There's no way it's going to pull back. No, it's not terrible, John. It's not terrible at all. I mean, you could literally, you could have already been out and had a one or two. If you would have gotten there, <laughs> I don't know where you got in, but. Q's chilling. Yeah. Typically a good sign and wants to go higher, but 
you know, you never know with news in a couple of minutes. Let's see. Nothing today, clear. Unlike last week, freaking news every second. News or earnings every freaking day. To the short side, I presume. Yeah. I assume that's what you're talking about. No, definitely. I just, I think because we bounce off this demand so aggressively that this demand holds truly. It's kind of my synopsis of it. Bro, we're going to miss it. What do you mean? It's right here. Yeah, it'd be, it'd be this one, Matt, Matthew. This one. You have low, high, strong low, break. And like trading at. So, yes. What you don't want is that we're trading at it doesn't it doesn't have to close below ftnt and uber they are swing there karen would love a pullback What are you doing? You're going to get electrocuted. Hey. Tanner, what kind, of, what kind of dog do you have? One. Tibetan Mastiff. Like, I don't like how aggressive this buying is, but maybe that's just what we need. Oh, it's so fluffy. It's so fluffy. I don't know why it opened in a new tab. Oh. Does it shed like crazy? So he sheds twice a year for two months or he sheds twice a year for a total of two months. <laughs> yeah, for okay. Dang, we're not going to get the pullback, man.
the fun I did, babe. Oh, come on. A lot of waiting here. I don't know, that might have been that. We kind of reject off this one minute supply here. That might be it. That might be all she wrote, gents. Rico, what's up, dude? What up? Looking for a pullback on Tesla here. Playing some puts. Let's see if we get it. We might get this. Let's see the point now where like. No, nah, I think I still like it. John got stopped out. Maybe, or he hit his target. Nice, bro. You got stopped out or you got out up here? I mean, what was your target, John? What was your target? Oh, yeah, yeah. I mean, you have a one to four hour trade. Did you get in right here or did you get in up here? Come on, dude. Uh, I don't think, I don't know. I think we're going to get filled. We're not going to get filled. What was your entry there, John? Forty-five. Yeah, right up there. Yeah, I mean, truly, I don't really trade that way. Because if if you're entering there, you'd want to see a break of structure there. If you're entering here or here. Let me just look at like a 15 minute. Yeah, if you want to enter here, you would look at this break of structure. See? Enter right there. Doesn't mean you'd win, but I mean, you'd have a one to two and a half hour trade. You have a pretty good chance of winning. Bro, you're kidding me. Oh my gosh, you're kidding me. That was an absolute banger of a trade. Uh, NVIDIA, NVIDIA. Uh, no, don't want to take it, Willie. You can. I'm not taking it. Gap up creates new high. Pull back, next move higher. Not doing it. Bro, you're kidding me. Literally, I could have had my stop here or my target here too. I just, I was thinking 50% up in here. Put it a little before that. Uh, uh. <laughs>
I don't know, dude. <laughs> no. I'm just being dramatic. I don't know, Gabe. I'm thinking about it, contemplating. We don't bounce off anything. I don't have the mantle down here. So I might. Yeah, no, I'm good. If we make a new low, I will definitely pull OCO out. Yeah. I'll go ahead and pull it. Bummer, man. That was a banger. I'm going to pull it. Yeah, I pulled off that OCO there. Yeah, like the probability of us going boom, 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 and then rotating is next to none. <laughs> Get rid of that. And like I said, you, you guys can take that. I'm not going to. Trading at supply, not really doing anything crazy. Yeah, but we've, tra we've traded at supply for so long. I don't think we're going to get that confirmation. And like, even if we took out this low, that's not a break of structure. So, not a break of structure on meta. To the downside? No. This? That is that. That is the clue. That would be liquidity, my friend. See? That's not even a low. No one we're in? Oh, this. Yeah. Yeah, I just don't see that. Yes, cancel the, the Tesla short trade. Yeah, yeah. Yes. We made a new low. Get her down. Get her down. Unfortunate events there. <laughs> oh, brother. Not our cows. My dad thought maybe our cows got out this morning because uh, one of our, another guy with some land up there said that he sees some cows on his alfalfa. But we have a camera. And they're all up there. There they are. We're safe.
You but you know I do, bro. Where have you been? You know I do, man. Yep. We got about 60 head cows. And then we have irrigated, dry land. Country boy. But I'm literally not country at all. If you saw me, I'd be wearing I'm wearing a Carhartt. That's kind of country, but I'm wearing athletic shorts. And I typically wear Birkenstocks or Hoka's. Sometimes some Sinooks. I so I definitely look more of a beach beach vibes. Yeah, I I stopped using head the head and shoulders pattern oh three years ago. So it what we look for is kind of like a head and shoulders, but it's not head and shoulders. So we would have a High, a low, a lower high, which would hopefully retrace 50% or more from the previous high. Let's just pretend it does. Boom. A lower low. And then we want to see a break of our lower high from our lower low. That's what we call a change in trend or a break of structure. Okay. When I get that, I am then looking for an entry, okay? My stop would go below that low. My target would go, you know, to the next high or to the next supply zone, whatever it is. And my entry would fluctuate based off my risk to reward, okay? But my entry would, base, would fluctuate based off my risk to reward, okay? And this is the exact setup that we teach inside of our mentorship program, right? Um, that you could actually get access to, Jai, um, if you want to. You just click that link down below, and you can watch the free training, and it will walk you through that. Um, but that's what we do. Right? That's one of the four or five different setups that we teach, right? Um, and it does look like a head and shoulders pattern, but it's not a head and shoulders pattern, right? Typically, it's going to lead to demand bounce. Lower high, lower low, break, pull back, move up. Or like this one, right? High, low, lower high, higher, sorry, lower high, higher low, higher high, break. I was looking for a pullback to play the move lower. I just didn't get the pullback that I needed exactly, unfortunately. But you can obviously see it, it's working. You can obviously see it's working. And then here, the reason I'm not getting short right now on NVIDIA is although we have a high, sorry, low high, lower high, sorry, higher low, lower low. Jeez, my verbiage is getting messed up. We have low, high, higher low, lower high, lower low. But if I look left, we never actually broke the low that created this high, that took out these highs, right? So we haven't really changed trend on this one minute time frame. We're in an uptrend, right? MGM. I didn't know you worked for MGM, dude. Did they give you company stock? Whoa, is that a balance, man? 
Let balance theory play. Whoa. Looky there, boys and girls. They don't give you company stock and it's a public company. That's crazy. They don't have a, they don't have a stock program. Dude, that's sick. Tell them that you're going to leave if you don't, they don't give you stock. Uh, hmm. I assume the uh, options aren't great on it. I would assume. I could be wrong. So what did you want me to look at? Oh, same, yeah, okay, you're thinking balance. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, the only thing is we have supply right in the freaking middle. So that's the only thing. It's the only negative. Let's see what we're doing here. Look at that buyer stepping in. I doubt it's against the their policy. It, it, I don't think it would be unless if you had some type of news based off your trade. Like if you were getting long on MGM because of balance theory, I, I don't think they can get you in trouble for insider trading. <laughs> Truly. Yeah, I think you'd be fine. Wait, Tanner, you, you hit a Google short off open or right here. I assume you got in right there. That's what I assume you did. Probably like that. Ballsy. Quick scout type beat. You hear me?
Well, boys and girls. No, 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 I'm not doing Tesla. I'm not taking it. I'm not taking it. I'm not taking it. No, 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 no. It could still work. I'm not, no, I'm not touching it. You can. <laughs> you have you have my permission, but Dang blood. Everything else kind of holding up. This is the only thing that's kind of being volatile. Well, team, might just call it today. And bot's looking good. Hey, anyone else in here have the bot? Yup. How's it doing for you, Alec? I know you kind of gotten late, so. Nice, bro. Yeah, I'm up good too. I'm up three percent on the day. Uh, I'm not sure my total. That's the one thing I hate about Thinkorswim. I was like, wait, shot. Wow, got it. What do you mean? 
<laughs> what do you mean, wow, got it? What are you referring to? Speak. It came down. Wow, got it? What are you talking about? Are you behind, maybe? Look at Tesla dump, man. So close. So close. Yeah, mine, as long as I can have MO stay above 40, stay out of the money here, as long as it keeps pumping, we'll be good. Yeah, I think it will through the end of the week. I have the uh, bear put, no, bull put spread, credit spread on MO. As long as we close above 49.50, we're good for the week. That should be good. Coca Cola is like 60, close above. Oh, sorry, it's 49.50. Yeah, yeah. Coca Cola is above 67, we're at 68.80. I'm out of the money on all of them, so we should be good. Right, dude? Oh, so close. So freaking close. Well, boys and girls, I'm going to call it. But hey, I appreciate you guys hopping on to the live stream. It's always, it's always fun, even though we don't... We did not take anything, right? Still fun. Still fun to hop on with you and, and dive into the market. But um, again, I'll be live next Wednesday. If you guys can for me, make sure if you don't already subscribe to the channel, uh, make sure you like this video as we're ending it off here. Um, again, no trades for me today, but that's okay. Um, had a couple setups that just didn't get the entry that I wanted. And there will be plenty more opportunities. I'm not stressing about that, but um no, enjoy the rest of your day, guys. And again, thanks for hopping on.